They explained to me that I had a very suspicious looking lesion that they suspected was probably cancer. They scheduled me um, in a few days for a stereotactic biopsy. Um, during that procedure, uh, I must have, they must have hit a vein and I had a bleed and they tried to continue but they couldn't so they suggested that possibly they should try a uh, sonogram needle biopsy. They weren't able to because the hematoma was masking the area that was suspicious. They scheduled a breast MRI for me and I, I thought I might have a problem because I am a little claustrophobic but I thought well I'm certainly going to give it a try and they said oh you'll be fine we can give you a little sedative beforehand if you like. As soon as I got in that MRI with you know face down and the machine started coming around me and started touching my body, I just panicked. Following that, they did the PEM scan and my right breast just lit up with the area of cancer. The PEM biopsy, um, which happened a few days later, they were able to remove the cancer cells, have them tested, find out that I had uh, of kind of a rare kind of breast cancer called triple negative, and it's very aggressive apparently. So I was so glad to find out that I had cancer and that I was still in a period of time where I could be treated because I might have gone home and it could have, you know, six months could have gone by and who knows what would have happened. I would definitely recommend a PEM scan for anyone who's going through any type of, uh, where they have a suspicious area that needs to be examined further. Uh, in my case, there was nothing else that would have worked because it was deep inside my breast back against the chest wall and I don't think there's any other method that would really have taken care of that and found it so that I was able to treat it and um, you know be here today. <laughs>